Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to basically show you how you can work from home full time as a professional nerd. So if you're into movies, if you're into gaming, anime, comic books, any of that kind of stuff, comicbook.com may be a website you know about, and it is a pretty large website that covers news and all kinds of topics related to comic books and movies, gaming, all of that stuff. So they're a big like media brand for that kind of industry and they have a work from home job available right now where you get to actually work full time from home covering this kind of stuff so the thing about comicbook.com is the jobs can be kind of hard to find because they are actually uh, part of like a network of companies where they have a parent company which is CBS Interactive so if you go to their careers, sometimes it'll say that they don't have any jobs available. And you can see right here, uh, but the job will be posted somewhere else. So if you go to um, the CBS Interactive Jobs page, you can do a quick Google search for that, or I'll have a link in the show notes to it. Um, but you can go here at cbsinteractive.com, go to the careers page, and then when you're on this page here, what you want to do is go to location and go down to remote and location. Um, and then click search and that will narrow down the search results to just work from home type jobs. So you have a few different ones here available. You'll notice one of them says editor at comicbook.com. So that's the one we're going to look at here. Just look for something uh, that has to do with the particular websites you want to work for that CBS Interactive is the parent company for. So if you type in comicbook.com, narrow down the results to remote, then you should be able to find when they have work from home jobs for comicbook.com. So right now they have an editor position that is full time and completely remote. You'll notice right here that you can uh, just kind of read through here. The day-to-day -day involves like SEO, editing, writing, blog posts, and news posts about all sorts of things related to things like comics and TV, movies, video games, comic, uh, not comics, but anime, all that stuff. So you need to be also be able to make data-driven decisions. Again, SEO, social media, different types of internet marketing and editing, writing, those are the kinds of uh, skills you're going to need. So some of the specific qualifications, you need a bachelor's degree in journalism or another related field. Again, marketing is a lot that goes into this. You could probably have something in that background at least two years professional editorial experience, excellent communication and written skills. A lot of the rest of them are just kind of basic skills you would usually see. Um, and then you could apply by clicking the orange button at the top or bottom of the page. Uh, if you want more information about these companies, I'm gonna show you a few different pages for you to go to. So uh, the first thing is if you want to research about how much money you might make at a position, I recommend a website called payscale.com. Um, they're one of the more specific ones out there. So if you wanted to look up the company, you could look at CBS Interactive average salary, $83,000 or so. Um, but if you looked at the average editor salary, which sometimes the specific job that's available is posted on Payscale under that company, sometimes sometimes it's not. But this one, you have average like editor salary, maybe like in the US, uh, obviously, obviously you wanna check based on what country it's available in, but the, it's about 51,000 per year, you know, as well as 34,000 a year, as high as 83,000 a year. So somewhere in that range, um, you know, it obviously will vary, but some other research you can do before applying for this job, you can look up CBS Interactive, and the reason I'm looking up CBS Interactive on a lot of these sites instead of comicbook.com is because in many cases, the parent company is the one that people leave reviews for because otherwise they'd have all these different pages of companies that are under this bigger company and they would just have reviews all over the place. So uh, the major company is CBS Interactive and 
they have 506 view, reviews for a three and a half out of five star rating. You could read more about salaries and what it's like to work for these companies on this page here. And at indeed.com, you can do the same thing. They have 67 reviews with a three and a half out of five star rating. And you can read um, some of that as well. So you can get an idea of whether it's worth working there, about how much salary you might make. And if you want other work from home jobs that are available like this one, like many others, whether you want something that's data entry, whether you want something that's no experience needed, or you want something that doesn't require a degree or whatever kind of work from home job you might want. I actually have a page dedicated to this at selfmadesuccess.com under online jobs. Just click that tab in the top right, scroll down here, and you should be able to find something that you uh, might be looking for. And I have links posted for all of the direct pages to go apply. So. Hopefully this was helpful for you. If you want more work from home jobs that have been available in, in the past month or so, check out that playlist that should be showing up in the top right of this video. And you can go here to the website, selfmadesuccess.com for show notes. So other than that, I hope this was helpful for you and I will see you in the next video.